Hey guys, it's me again, and um, well, I guess I'll show you how to back up your DVDs, you know, keep them, uh, keep your DVDs from getting scratched, all that, whatever reason you want to back up your DVD, but I always showed you, you know, the best, quickest, simple way. This, uh, this uh, tutorial is going to be a little bit more different, this one's going to be backing up your DVD, and um, but in a different way, you're going to keep all your quality of your DVD. Because a lot of times when you back up a DVD, from, you know, every movie you buy out there in the, s in the uh, market or whatnot, it's in a dual layer DVD. And what most of these uh, softwares do when you back up, they just make that DVD and, uh, you know, chop down the quality so it'll fit into your uh, single layer blank DVD so um, yeah let's get started this is gonna be a tutorial on how to keep your quality in your uh, backup DVD as you guys know I like to use DVD fab and the reason why is because I get to uh, keep these folders of the movies and uh, in a second I'll show you why I like to do this uh, all these DVDs are dual layer I can't I can you know I can shrink them there's other ways of shrinking them but if you shrink them you're gonna lose a lot of quality so this way is gonna um, uh, this tutorial is gonna show you how to keep your um, keep your quality up Alright, so you know, once you pop your DVD in there, you got your folders, you got everything, you got your movie going, right? Go ahead and open up this one called uh, VOB Blanker. Um, I just found this off of Google. You can type in VOB Blanker and uh, you'll get it up there. Okay, let's get going. Let's get this going, guys. Go ahead by um, input up here the first one you want to browse and uh, you gotta browse for those folders that I was telling you about so I like to keep mines like that alright let's do monsters Inc. Uh, open up the video file it's just gonna find one one file and it's the IFO file this is the main movie the whole background to your movie this is what your DVD players read this what this is what tells your DVD it's a DVD go ahead and open that up it's gonna take a couple of seconds get this program going I like this uh, it's pretty simple once you get the uh, the rhythm going you know okay here we go guys you see I got my movie in there and now it's showing me the VOB, the video backups. This is what's in the DVD. As you can see here, this is the, uh, what is this? 4.421 megabytes. So that's a 4 gigabyte right here, just on this. And the movie contains uh, all these trailers, all these, all this crap I don't want. So what I'm going to do is just I'm just going to keep going through all of these. You see this one it has uh, pieces at the bottom. These pieces are your uh trailers. You see them up here guys? So I don't want these trailers. I, I hate trailers. Look how much um megabytes this is taking up. This is taking up 229 megabytes that I could, you know, keep on the uh on the main movie and keep my quality up. So what I want to do is I want to blank this out. I don't want I don't want this. It's 85 megabytes just this one trailer. So let's blank it out. Next one is a 5 minute another trailer of I want to back I want to blank this out too. Next one more trailers, blank that out. Blank this trailer. I don't want a trailer. And another trailer. Blank. This one. What was this? Another trailer. I'm just gonna blank that out. So the whole thing I just blanked out. 
it went from uh, 229 megabytes all the way down to 190 kilobytes. Of course, you're not going to be able to, you know, blank the whole thing, but it'll do pretty good for you. Okay, here we have another one. Uh, what is this? Is this extras or is this the movie? It's an hour long, so I'm guessing this is a movie. So I'm going to skip that and just continue to the next one. You see these? These are the FBI warnings and the whatnot. Let's just blank these out too. Okay, we went from uh, almost a megabyte all the way down to uh, 50 kilobits. Next one. Look, we got more of these uh, useless crap that DVDs have nowadays. So we want to blank these out. Just keep blanking out anything that you see in the video that you don't want. These are pretty small anyway, so I'm just going to leave these 14 kilobits. This one's 79 kilobits, so I'm guessing these are like trailers or whatever. So I'm just going to blank these out. More trailers. Alright. Once that's done, and um, I got all everything I don't want shrunken and chopped up. Once I got that all chopped up and everything, I'm gonna set over here uh, output folder. You're gonna wanna. What I like to do is I like to create another folder inside of it and uh, name it. I like to rename it. Monsters. This is gonna be my uh, backup. And I'm going to put it in there. Monsters Backup. Or whatever movie you got. Such and such backup. Or whatever you want to do, guys. Hit OK. And once you got your folders going and everything, hit Process. It's going to take, um, I don't know, a minute, two minutes to blank out all that uh, useless stuff. So let's wait around and see see how it goes actually um, I'll cut this out and um, I'll continue on a part two guys it's getting kinda long this video so stay tuned for uh, the next part